Well, well, what's happening here then? Hey, there we go. Hey, what's going on, guys? Today I'm gassed because it's two o'clock. We are going to see Drake today. The assassination tour. Yeah, all right. We're in London, O2. I am actually gassed. Your boy, cheese on the fleek. I don't know. No, no one ever used that word. So you don't know why I said that. But you know, I'm, I'm just gassed. You know what I mean? Like, first time I've seen Drake as well. I've seen loads of other artists live, but I've never seen Drake live. It's going to be mad. Don't know who he's going to bring out. Could be UK artists. Could be US artists. I'm not sure. Let's go and find out. Wait, hang on a second. Let me just retract back the hand. Before you do start watching this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you're a fan of Drake. If you're a fan of me, even, yeah, you know, funny enough. And turn that post notifications on. Now, let's go for real. Bow. We're going to take you on the ride. We've got the, the, um, the tickets here. Wait, where, where is it then? Have, have, I, have I just lost them? Oh, wait, actually, where is it? <sighs> Guys, your boy has actually lost the ticket. How have I lost the tickets? This is, this is not stage, not written. I've genuinely lost the tickets. If you look back to the footage there, my face was just like... I don't know what to do. I think, I know I can still get in. It's not the end of the world. You can just like, show your phone or whatever. But I've just, I've lost my Drake tickets, alright? I'm mad. Ladies and gentlemen, you're not going to believe this, but out of all the people there, they chose us. Yes, they chose us. Sky, shout out to Sky. They chose us to go VIP backstage. Now, obviously, initial thoughts, we thought we was going to meet the main man himself, Drizzy fucking Drake. But obviously, no, it was just a nice lounge area. We got selected. It was only like a selected hundred people. Nice lounge area. You can sit down, chill out, away from all the rowdy, loud noisy crowd and things like that there was a bar there was drinks there was food just a nice chill area and here's some of that footage <laughs> Drake 
more, please. They want one more.
Guys, we are home. It's been a long day at the Drake concert, of course. He brought out so many people. Future. It was just it was just crazy gigs. Everyone was there, all the UK men, and obviously, you know, your boy copped the assassination just holy. It was quite expensive, but you know, on the back as well. I mean it, it, you can call it cringy, but it's just sick. Like it's just good, isn't it? But this quality today is looking really good. I'm, I'm getting being nice to this. I just wanna say big love to Drizzy Drake. He done his thing today as per usual. It's the first time seeing him and Probably one of the best performances I've seen like live ever. Like straight back there. Like everything from the stage presence to like how it was set out to like literally the, all the songs he done. Some of the oldies, some of the new songs he also announced he's got a new album. Why is Netflix playing in the background? And more importantly, the message he said there to everyone was something that I came back and actually learned from that concert um, more than anything and took some inspiration from. Thank you guys ever so much for watching. If you did, what is Vinny doing? If you did like this video, be sure to bit, leave a big fat thumbs up, subscribe down below. Uh, subscribe for, for Drake. If, you, if you're a Drizzly fan, subscribe for him too. Turn on the post notifications. And I'll see you guys in a bit.